this is question based on the Lagrange theorem group order hai 60 then what is the possible order of the subgroup by Lagrange order of subgroup divide order of group we have to find divisor of 60 that is possible order of s equals to 1 2 3 4 5 6 10 12 15 K V a subgroup of proper subgroup of S and S be the proper subgroup of G where G is finite and given that order of K equals to suppose 42 and order of G equals to 420 then what is the then what is the possible order of H let order of H equals to N so by Lagrange order of K should divide N because this is the subgroup of H and N should divide order of G it imply order of k 42 divide n and here n divide 420 this means there exist this device this there exist k1 belongs to z and for this there exist suppose k2 belongs to some integer z k2 belongs to z we can write 4 2 into k1 equals to n and n into k2 equals to 420 42 k1 equals to n and n k2 equals to 420 mm. we can write this n equals to 42 k1 this is suppose one this is second now second divided by one so n k2 equals to 420 divided by n divide 42 k1 this is k1 into k2 equals to this is 10 okay then possible product of k1 and k2 make if k1 equals to 1 if k1 equals to 1 k2 must be 10 k2 k1 2 then this is 5 this is 5 this is 2 this is 10 this is 1 this is the possible combination of k1 and k2 whose product is 10 but order of s equals to n where n is 42 into k1 now 42 into 1 42 into 2 yani 84 these are the possible order of h order of g equals to p into q this is p and q are prime it imply a proper subgroup of g is cyclic since possible order of proper 
subgroups is 1, P and Q. Trivial is cyclic and prime order are cyclic it imply proper subgroup of G is cyclic order of UN is even if n is strictly greater than 2 we know un x comma n is equals to 1 and x is less than n since n minus 1 belongs to un n minus 1 is square equals to n square minus 2n plus 1 we can write n n minus 2 plus 1 if we take multiplication modulo n then n 1 is square can be written 1 mod n 1 mod n is called love yeah n minus 1 operation n minus 1 gonna pay remainder 1 array therefore order of n minus 1 equals to 2 thus we can say order of un is even because by Lagrange theorem order of elements should divide order of group so here order of element is 2 so 2 divide order of un hence un must be even this theorem say converse of converse of lagrange theorem holds in finite cyclic group if a b a cyclic group of order suppose 20 then about 2 must divide 20 it imply there exist h subgroup of this such that whose order is 2 similarly 4 divide 20 it imply there exist subgroup of this whose order is 4 similarly we find the divisor of this 20 20 and get different different subgroup for this theorem proof let G be a finite cyclic group which is generated by A suppose M divide N then we shall so there exist subgroup H of G such that order of H equals to M since M divide N it implies there exist any integer K 
such that m k equals to n let h be a cyclic let h be a cyclic group generated by this element a k and order of h equals to order of a k now we show that order of a k equals to m now a to the power k to the power m equals to a to the power k m equals to what is m m a to the power m k equals to n we can write n equals to but n is the order of a so we can write this is e since order of a equals to e sorry order of a equals to n now we to show this m is the least positive integer for this suppose a k to the power t equals to also e it imply order of a must divide k t it imply n divide k t it imply what is n n equals to m k divide k t it imply m divide t it means m is least therefore order of a k equals to m which is order of h the theorem is proved